right guys so we are at the quilters cocoon quilters cocoon is probably about one i'd say about an hour away from my house it was a nice easy drive nice parking lot here it appears that all the cars are right in front of the quilting store so i'm betting that it's going to be kind of busy in there which is fine that doesn't bother me at all um during this pandemic the only places i really feel comfortable are at the quilting stores and well i go to the quilting stores and then i go to the grocery store because i have to but those are pretty much my outings um let's see what we have in here on the website it says that they are the leaders in, in uh, southern california for carrying cake we'll see if that's true um they say Roxanne's carries a large amount of case too. I think they both make that same claim, so we'll see. Although I've never been to Roxanne's and Roxanne's is closed, so I don't know how we'll see. But let's just hop on in here and see what they have. All right, let's see. So when you first walk in, you see it's huge. It feels so big and airy and light. And in the back, they were having a kind of a sew along with just a couple of ladies, but beautiful setup um valentine's day is coming they have that beautiful valentine's day quilt there and to the right they have their holiday stuff in the front they have that big O handy quilter um long arm machine and then here they have another handy quilter mid arm machine so again their holiday stuff is there with some valentine's day fabrics and they have a ton of like insole bright, your steamer seams, your battings, like your different um, things that you would use inside of a quilt, which is pretty cool. You see the bowl cozy pre um, cut stuff over there, all the pre battings because bowl cozies are all the rage. Expect a bowl cozy video coming for me very, very soon. Then they have that pretty set up there showcasing some clothes. And here is the cave. They are cafe heavy for sure. To the left is their um, their grunge, which is super cool. They have like all the grunges and all the caves. Oh, it's cafe crazy down this aisle on the left, pretty much that whole wall. And to the right, those shelves are all cafe. And then the rest of the fabrics are just a mix of other brands that they carry. But that wall back there of those Elizabeth Hartman um, jungle abstractions, they're done in cafes, which I don't think I've ever seen before. I've seen people do them in different colorways, but not cafe. And they are absolutely stunning up close. Like, I love them. So you'll also see a ton of tuffets around the store, which I love. Expect one of those coming soon, too. Um, they have, like, the kits for those. They really like those, apparently. That's the only thing they sell on their website. Online, they do not, you're, you can't buy anything except for tuffet kits. Um, all fabric has to be bought in the store. They're closed on Sundays and Mondays, which makes me sad, but that's okay. Here are some country chic fabrics from, I think those are Moda. And then there's Tula. They have a really good um, selection of Tula pinks there and then some ombre fabrics down there. That's my fabric pull sitting on top of that counter. What? Crazy pull, right? And they have some really neat patterns available. They have a ton of patterns in the back of their store too and that you can kind of flip through and I can get lost in there because I just love buying patterns. I start pattern first and then I fill in with fabric. Some people start with the fabric first and fill in with the pattern, but I am a pattern girl. They have hoops there for baskets that you can make, um, some embroidery threads, and island quilt patterns. I love those island quilt patterns there at the top. And then I don't know who, whose patterns are below them. But they're holiday-esque patterns there. Fourth of July patterns or quilts of valor. Some more kind of country chic. Some modern ones. The suburbs. Those houses there. Chickens. I kind of want to do the chickens. I don't know why. I want to make some funky chickens. And here we are back to the holiday section. They have a nice Christmas tree quilt there. I think they sell that as a kit. And then here are their holiday fabrics with a ton of Valentine's Day fabrics down at the bottom. Aren't they pretty in all their pinks and reds? They look nice. 
And then we're going to circle back around and uh, you'll see some more Tula in the bottom right there. And they did some huge stockings. Like remember the stocking I made is like a quarter of that size. So that's pretty much the shop guys. Thanks so much for hanging out with me. Okay, so I am now back in the car and my first thoughts are that store is so cute and they have a cute bathroom which I think all quilt stores should have a, quilt, a cute bathroom. I mean, it's what we do, right? And you know you've got the little classes. They have a place to hold classes in the back. And it's cute. Like, it's just a super cute store. They do have a ton of cave. A ton of cave. Um, what else? They are, I mean, they, it's just a cute store. And they have their long arm in the front. And they have a mid-arm, and you can rent time on both of them. I think they sell handy quilters, which is really cool. Um, just a really nice store. They were very, very friendly. The other kind of people who will pull bolts where you like, try this. You like this colorway? No? Let's switch it out. Let's try another one. If you are not good with color, come in here, you know, and, and see if somebody can kind of help you pull your colors for your quilts. They have a class that they do to teach you to do long arm. And what I like about that is you can split the cost with a friend. So I think the cost is like 125 I have to look at the paperwork. But if you and a friend want to learn how to long arm, you have to take the class first. Then you have to buy some notions and stuff. And then they float theirs on top, which is super cool, which means, you know, you don't have to be worried about painting. I don't know. What am I talking about? Like, I know. But just a nice store I'm really happy to have found them if you're looking for patterns they have a ton of Elizabeth Hartman patterns here they have some bag patterns they have cute quilts um, on the walls to get inspiration from but yes case is definitely their thing I can't wait till Roxanne's opens up so I can see which one but they're on such opposite sides of the city if you are in the Riverside area, this is your spot for case. They have a good selection of Tulip Pink, which is also Free Spirit. They have a nice selection of Hoffman and Moda. I'm pleased. I wonder how long I've been in there. Probably for like an hour and a half, maybe even two hours, guys. Who knows? I can get in a quilt store and just nap. Just, just camp out. Camp out in the quilt store. All right, guys. I will see you Oh, on my next one. All right. Bye-bye. Thank you.